perfect September afternoon for college football here in Evanston. Northwestern and Northern Illinois meeting for the eighth time and the first time since 2005. Dan Vitale motions left to right, snap to Simeon, drops to throw on third down, looking over the middle, got a man wide open, it's Miles Schuler, and down at the 38, first down. Find that receiver. First down, snap to Simeon, he's going deep down the near side for Dickerson, and it is intercepted in the end zone. A diving over the shoulder interception by Paris Logan. 11 minutes to go, second quarter, no score. Justin Jackson gets the handoff, 40, 45. Out near midfield goes the freshman. A nice burst up the middle by Jackson. Third and eight here for their own 22-yard line. Northern showing blitz. They drop back, snap to Simeon, heaves it down the right side for Vitelli. Makes the catch at the 45 and out of bounds. Deep corner to Vitelli. Snap to Simeon. Rushes on, Simeon down the seam. Nobody home incomplete thrown in the general direction of Vault that he wasn't looking for the ball down around the 35 yard line. 42 seconds to go in the half. Back up tight end Maxwell on a wing right play fake. Hare wants to throw, steps up under pressure and he is sacked. Sacked on the play. Colin Ellis and Dean Lowry. They try to score the first points of this game. Here's the snap, placement, kick is up and the kick is good. And Northern Illinois has finally broken the scoreless deadlock. First down NIU from their own 24. Hare steps up, he's going deep for Lewis. Down the left seam and it's broken up beautifully. Great play for the Wildcats by Matthew Harris. Hare back to throw it here. Pocket collapsing, chasing behind by Gibson. Gibson's got him and takes him down. Back at the 20 yard line. Deontay Gibson takes down Hare. A second down, Simeon to throw. Downfield, complete, Kyle Prater, first down in NIU territory. Prater with a reception. Simeon with Green to his left. And Trevor looking to throw it here. Simeon with time, downfield, open, Prater, touchdown! Kyle Prater, leaping grab at the goal line. His first touchdown as a Wildcat. And the Cats have their first points today, and they take the lead with 4.51 to go in the third quarter. But well, was all set up by good defensive play, which gave them good field position, and then they rock it down the field. And how about that little skinny over the middle seam route? And it's a touchdown. Great throw. Happy for Kyle Prater. Lewis in a slot right, and Hare keeps it throwing downfield. Caught Brown reaching for the end zone. Touchdown, Northern Illinois. And NIU goes back in front here with 52 seconds to go in the third quarter. On third down, snap to Simeon. Trevor now rolls to the right. Simeon looking downfield, throwing. It's caught inside the 30 by Kyle Prater. And 19 yards to go. Huskies at their own 41, and the snap to Hare. And Hare wants to go deep. Heaves it deep downfield. Caught at the 15 to the 10 of the five, and Deron Brown has a touchdown. 59-yard touchdown pass right down the left hash. And it'll be Hare taking himself right side, reaches for the end zone, touchdown. Drew Hare on the touchdown run, and Northern has put this game away, it would appear, with 327 remaining. Here on third down, Oliver is going deep. Youngblood Airy makes the catch, 15-10, five, touchdown! touchdown. How about that? The backup quarterback comes in, and it's the home run ball to Youngblood Airy. His first career touchdown. Mitchell, the onside kick, and it's going to be covered up by Duran Brown at the 44 of Northwestern with 2.33 to go. This will be the last snap of the game right here. As Hare takes a knee. This ball game is over, and for the first time ever, the Northern Illinois Huskies have beaten their in-state rivals, the Northwestern Wildcats. The two coaches, Pat Fitzgerald and Rod Carey, exchange handshakes at the middle of the field. We've not hit triple zeros yet on the clock. In fact, the clock has stopped with 15 seconds, but both teams are out on the field. Well, it's all over, and Northern Illinois has beaten the Wildcats by a final score of 23 to 15.